Hi guys, and welcome to the Family Fudge, and welcome to another week of school lunch inspiration, this time with a very colorful twist. Okay guys, now just a few things before I get started. Now like I said, this week I'm going with a colorful theme. So each day of the week I'm gonna pick a different color and we're gonna go with that. I'm gonna to try to find all the foods in that color, if I can. I'm gonna do that this week and next week as well. So stay tuned for that. And now on to my favorite part of the week, the shout out. This week it's going to Riley Horn for leaving us our first comment on last week's video. Now let's get started. Good morning friends and welcome to Monday. The color of the day is red. Here's how I made it. I actually started by making up a big batch of my ranch dressing. We were all out so I definitely wanted to make a new batch for the entire week. I do have a separate video on how I make the ranch. I'll go ahead and link it down below. Next I prepared my lunch boxes. I added some red napkins and some cupcake liners to make it look fun. Now over in this back corner, I have a few cherry tomatoes with a little bit of ranch in with them. Over in this corner, I have some mini Baby Bell cheese and I went ahead and peeled it for the kids just to make it easier for them to open. I know sometimes Lily has a hard time with these guys. Over in this corner, I have some turkey pepperoni and I added these to a cute little skewer. Of course, it's a red skewer and it makes it really fun. Over in this corner, I have some new special crackers that we're trying today. These are the creamy tomato soup crackers from Trader Joe's and they don't taste like tomato soup. They actually taste like pizza. They're really good, but we'll see if the kids like them. I'm not sure. Today we're also trying some new little yogurt cups. Aren't these cute? I found these at the Dollar Tree. They have a little lid that screws on. They're perfect for yogurt and snacks, things like that. So I started by adding just a little bit of vanilla yogurt to each cup. And then of course, since the theme today is red, I added a few raspberries on top. Lastly, I'm also sending the kids with a little treat today. This is the apple strawberry fruit wrap from Trader Joe's. It's like a fruit leather. It's very tasty. In here we have apple juice, apple puree, strawberry juice, strawberry puree, and elderberry juice. They're really very good. And now it's time to show the kids. Do you guys want to come see? Yeah! Whoa! Cool! Is it cool that everything is yeah. red? Yeah! Okay, so. Now it's time to get my lids on. I am gonna go ahead and put an ice pack in here today just to keep the yogurt cool and the cheese. I'll put them in the lunch boxes and that is it. And we'll see you when we get back. All right, time to check the lunches. We'll go ahead and start with Mackenzie's first. What do you think, Mackenzie? It was so good. You ate everything and your yogurt. What was your favorite part? I like the yogurt and the tomatoes. The tomatoes? I thought you didn't like tomatoes. I like them. Now you like them? Well, that's good. Do you like all the red foods? Yeah. Do you know what's coming tomorrow? No. What comes after red? Orange. That's right. Okay, time to check Jackson's. He's not here with us, but it looks like he did pretty good, except he didn't eat his cheese. But I think this is still good, so maybe he'll eat that later. And he ate his yogurt. But nobody used their napkin. <laughs> Your napkin's still at the bottom. I thought it was a decoration. That's okay. Is my lunch next, Mom? That's right, yours is next. Let's see how you did. Uh-oh, what happened? All I needed was a drink. All you needed was a drink? Mm -hmm. Well, you didn't eat any tomatoes. You did eat your cheese. You left one and a half crackers and a couple pieces of pepperoni, so. Next time you gotta eat more, right? Yeah. But did you eat your yogurt? Yeah. Oh, well, that's pretty good. And we'll see you on Tuesday. Good morning, guys, and happy Tuesday. Now today I actually don't have any helpers with me. They're off getting ready for the day. But I can go ahead and show you the lunch that I made, and today's theme is orange. So of course I started off by adding some napkins and some orange cupcake liners to my lunch boxes. Then I rolled up some turkey, cut out some cheese slices into some fun flower shapes. I also added some cheddar rockets. We love these crackers, they're from Trader Joe's and they're perfect because they're orange. 
Back here I have some carrots, which I've cut into a fun crinkle cut shape. And then over here I have one little cutie, and I made it really fun by adding some little eyes. Now to go along with this today, I'm also giving the kids a mango flavored yogurt. These ones are from Trader Joe's and they're really tasty. And then I also have a mango cereal bar. So I'll go ahead and get all my lids on here today. And then I will put in an ice pack because of the meat and the cheese and the yogurt. And then we'll head out the door. We're back home now and here's what we ate. <laughs> Good job guys. Right now I've got Mackenzie and Lily and Jackson here helping me say hi. Hi. So what did you think about the orange lunch today? I loved it. I see that Mackenzie, I see that Mackenzie ate everything. Good job. Let's see, Jackson left a couple bites of cheese and some carrots, but I didn't give him any ranch today. Lily also left some carrots, some crackers, and a little bit of her turkey. So what was your favorite part, Mackenzie? I like the yogurt. The yogurt. Did you like your yogurt, Lily? Yeah, the yogurt was the best part of my lunch. <laughs> Good job. Good morning, guys. And welcome to Wednesday. Now, normally on Wednesday, we eat lunch at home, but today we're actually headed to a special activity, so we're bringing our lunch. And as you can probably tell, the theme for today is yellow. So I started by adding my napkin and my cupcake liners to my lunchbox. Next, I went ahead and gave the kids some hummus right over here. And next to that, I have some corn chips to dip in there. Back over here, I have some of these freeze-dried mangoes. These are really good. They're actually crunchy and just a little bit sweet. Over in this back corner, I have some hard-boiled eggs. And I tried to use my star-shaped mold for these, but it didn't really work out this time. Sometimes it doesn't. I am remembering to put a little spoon in here today, and that is because I'm sending the kids with a yogurt. This is a lemon yogurt. And then for a treat, I'm also giving the kids some of these lemon Oreo thins. And so these guys right here. So they're like an Oreo, but smaller. Isn't that cute? Uh-huh. Do you need anything else? No. Nope. You think that's enough for you? Yeah. I was thinking about putting some yellow uh, bell pepper in there, but I don't have any and I'm, I don't think the kids would eat it. So this is lunch today. And we'll see you when we get back. Okay guys, it is much, much later now and I'm just getting around to checking the lunches again. I've been forgetting. But right now I have both Mackenzie and Lily here. Say hi. Hi. Okay, so you can already tell kind of how lunch went today. Overall, they did really well. There's just a couple of scoops of hummus left in each container. Maybe next time we need to pack them more chips. What'd you think, guys? It was good, but there was one problem. Yeah. My yogurt exploded all over my lunchbox. Uh, yeah. So I gave them a full size yogurt cup in their lunch today and it didn't, I guess it didn't fit very well and it got smushed or something happened. But one of my friends helped clean it up. That was really nice of them. And we'll see you tomorrow for the green lunch. Bye. Good morning, guys. And happy Thursday. Today our lunch is green. <laughs> That's right. So I started off by decorating my boxes with some green napkins and green cupcake liners. This is so easy to do and it doesn't cost a lot of money either. Next I prepared some cheese tortellini. This cooks so fast, just about three minutes. And then to make it green I added some of our favorite basil pesto. Now sometimes I will serve these warm, but other times I just serve them room temperature. They're totally good both ways. Now to go with our lunches today, I'm also giving the kids some cucumbers and I actually used my mini cookie cutter to make these into flower shapes. They are so cute. Over in this corner, I have some green grapes and I've included a cute little pick just for fun. Now I don't normally give the kids two fruits in one lunch, not that there's anything wrong with that, but I had some kiwis that I needed to use up so I went ahead and gave them a few slices of that as well. Now I am throwing in one more snack today. I have these little snack bags full of some snap peas, these are pea crisps, just like that. So it's kind of like a baked snack, yes. And these ones are the Caesar flavor. So what do you think, Mackenzie? It looks cool. Does it look like enough food today? Yeah. Okay, so I have to get all of my lids on. Um, I probably don't need to put in an ice pack today, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway since I have them available. And do you guys wanna take apple juice today? Yeah. Okay, well, we'll throw in some apple juice too. And we'll see you when we get back. Okay guys, we're back home now and I have all the kids here helping me. I even have Griffin. Can you say hi? Hi. Good job. Hi. 
All right, so let's check the lunches today. Here's Mackenzie's. Mackenzie, you ate everything, huh? Mm -hmm. What was your favorite part? I liked the ravioli and the grapes. Yeah, let's check Jackson's. Uh-oh, Jackson. He has a few grapes left and one single tortellini. So I guess it wasn't too bad. And let's check Lily's. Lily has a few cucumbers left, but she ate everything else, so that's really good. Lily, what did you like today? Mm, the kiwi. The kiwi. What about you, Jack? Mm, the cucumbers right here. The cucumbers. Very good. And we'll see you tomorrow. Now we can eat this. Yay! Good morning, guys, and welcome to Friday. I'm so glad that it's Friday. I actually don't have any helpers with me. They're all playing in their rooms. But as you can tell, today's theme is blue. And of course, I started by adding my napkin and my liners to my lunchbox. Now, because I couldn't think of any meat or protein that was naturally blue, I went ahead and just gave the kids our regular salami that they like, and I added it to a blue pig. And I put it in a blue container. Back over here, I gave the kids a handful of blueberries, and I added a little pick just for fun. In this section, I have a blue Baby Bell cheese, and then over here, I have a blueberry bar. These are the blueberry cereal bars I get from Trader Joe's. These are really good. The kids love them. I'm remembering to put a little spoon in there, and that is for the yogurt. I thought I was picking blueberry yogurt, but it actually says mountain huckleberry, but I think it's gonna taste like blueberry. We shall see. And finally, I'm also giving the kids a little bag of pretzels. These were perfect to throw in today because they're in a blue bag, but they're not actually blue pretzels. So now I'm gonna go ahead and get my lids on. I will need to put an ice pack today because of the yogurt. And then the kids will also be taking water. We're back home now, and here's what we ate. Good job, guys. Right now I've got Mackenzie and Lily and even Jackson here helping me say hi. 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 So what did you think about the blue lunch? I loved it. Yeah? Let's see how you did. Mackenzie ate her pretzels. She ate her cereal bar, and everything else is gone. Very good. What was your favorite part? I really liked the pretzels and the yogurt. No the yogurt. yogurt was good too. Yeah. Let's yeah, check yeah. Lily's. Oh no, this is Jackson's, it's not Lily's. Let's see, Jackson, you ate everything? Good job, what, what did you like the best? Maybe the yogurt and the baby bell cheese. The baby bell cheese, yeah. Let's check Lily's. Lily has one or two pretzels left. She ate all of her cereal bar. And you ate your yogurt or did you share it with Griffin? I, I kind of shared it with him. You shared it with Griffin, well that's nice. And let's see, your cheese is gone and everything else is gone. Did you eat all your salami? Mm -hmm. Yeah, good job. And we'll see you next week, bye! Okay friends, if you enjoyed this video today, please give it a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments down below, out of all the lunches this week, which one was your favorite? And let me know what your favorite color is. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.